everybody welcome back to my channel and if you are new here i'm alicia lover of makeup and glam rock the votes are in thank you all who participated every saturday i will be posting two products in my instagram story and you all will get a chance to vote which one is your favorite also keep on watching to find out how you could get featured in next week's video just want to remind you to also give this video a like, thumbs up, yeah. So now let's talk about the products. First one up is IGK Beach Club Volumizing Texture Spray. Ooh. This one of course is just a sample size. It is 1.0 ounces. They do have a travel size that is actually a 1.7 ounce and then a big size that is 5 ounces. The main place you can buy it is of course IGKHair.com and it is also seen at Sephora and Ulta. The price of the travel size is $14 and the bigger one is sold at $29 up to $31. Wow. What a price difference. And it is vegan and cruelty free. Yay. And it is free of gluten, parabens, petrolatum, mineral oil, and sulfates like SLS and SLES. Very nice. What's great about this little guy is that it protects you from UV ray protection. Yeah. And also heat protection. <coughs> Should be very conditioning and color safe for those who color their hair. Now usually these texture sprays have salt in them, but this one is salt free. But that doesn't mean that it won't give you very good volume and awesome beach waves. Also not drying out your hair, making it feel dull and heavy. Very heavy. Should be light. Safe for all hair types, even the chemically treated ones. And what's awesome about it is that because it is lightweight, it can be very buildable. Plus it is an aerosol spray, so that should help lift and add shine. The glycerin in this should add the moisture and texture for your hair. The hydrolyzed wheat protein in this is what helps add the volume and body to the hair. Ooh la la. Also has sunflower seed extract into it. The fragrance in this is meant to have the smell of guava coconut water, pink lotus, midnight violet, and vanilla. Interesting. Now how do you use this? You shake well. Mm -hmm. Make sure it's 10 to 12 inches away from your hair. You do want to section it so get your um, pins out or clippies and section the hair where you want to add the volume. So let's see if I could section this hair here. You want to get that clippy? You could clip it here if you're going to be doing another section down here. But since I'm not. Also with the spray, it's okay if you have wet hair or dry hair. You can still use it no matter what. I have dry hair right now, so we're going to do it on there. Basically, they mentioned that if you want an all-over texture, which is all over my head, you're going to want to spray it here make sure you get over here and spray all over and even flip your head upside down and just spray it try to get all of the layers and just you know go at it and then flip your hair back and well I already have volume in front but <laughs> the back area was where I sprayed look at that ooh la la if you want twisted hair, go ahead and this is probably going to work better if your hair is wet. But just to show you, you want to spray and then twist it. And then kind of just let it air dry. And then you'll have like really awesome beachy waves that way. If you're somebody who has curly hair, Go ahead and section your hair and spray the section and then you want to crunch it up or you can use a diffuser. That's okay as well. Let's try it out here. My faces that I make. I don't need no filters for that. 
blossom blossom and then this could also be used like on the section that you are blow drying so right before you blow dry go ahead and put it all over and blow dry your hair okay now moving on to the next one it is matrix biolage texturizing styling spray yeah. this one again is my little sample size one ounce the large one is eight ounces that's a pretty good size unfortunately it did just get discontinued can't believe it sad face mm. well that was more of a disappointing face mm. now what's pretty cool is that matrix when you click on this on their website it does give you a recommendation of what you can try it's actually just like another volumizing spray it's meant to add volume for fine hair but if you would like to give it a try to add that volume that you're looking for, it is called Volume Bloom Full Lift Volumizing Spray. Price is around $11 to $20 online. If you guys do find anything online, go ahead to comment below on where you find it. There are some um, independent shops that probably still do have it and still sell it in their stores. Other than that, it is enter at your own risk from this point on because Matrix is not selling it themselves. Just be careful when you buy them from these stores because they do no longer exist and uh, what you might be buying is just overstocked. This little guy should last you around 12 months. It has no artificial fragrance, no silicones, and no parabens it is natural origin and biodegradable also recyclable very nice uh, it does have the stamp r a w real authentic and wholesome wow. this texture spray should help your hair be defined and separated Ooh. that volume and texture should last around 24 hours and have a very clean feeling hmm. It does have matcha green tea extract in it, so that is a plus. There is magnesium sulfate and glycerin. Also silicic acid and sodium hydroxide. And this one is not in aerosol. So when you spray it, it's nice and wet. Ooh, like a shower. Now I tried looking online everywhere to see what kind of hair texture this one is meant for. There is nothing. I see nothing. So I'm guessing for all hair types, woo! I would just be a little bit careful if you are chemically treated or color treated because I am not sure if it is for you. But if you do find a way to get your hands on this, try a hair strand, see what it does to your hair. You know, just test it out first, of course. And um, if it's not for you, just don't use it. Okay, now what you want to do is shake it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then usually you want to do it on damp hair, not too wet, but about 80% dry. Go ahead and spray it all over that. Now I have seen videos, even by Matrix themselves, they have a video where they do use it on dry braided hair. The stylist had a client that their hair was already braided and styled and he was using it as the last product on the hair so he had braids in it and then just sprayed it all over to give it some kind of a shine or texture to it. And then go ahead and then spray it all over. It does mention to make sure it's nice and even and then after that you want to Go ahead, either air dry or blow dry, maybe with a diffuser if you have curled hair or wavy hair like me, I could use a diffuser. Feel free to style it as any way you like. I also saw another video on YouTube. Just go YouTube, there's different uh, videos with this little guy. There's one where he braided the hair and then he sprayed this and when he loosened up the braids, there was a nice wave to it. We'll go ahead and braid your hair after that go ahead and just spray yeah and then let it air dry after a while this is most likely when you're like 
out of the shower half wet uh, I could see if it tries to do something for my dry hair after this and then just go ahead and loosen up your hair and there should be some nice creative waves going on in there <laughs> I now have one twist and one braid I'm kind of liking the twist I might go all over my whole entire head with this guy yeah now we're going to go ahead with the results and the winner is 50-50 IGK and Matrix. Congratulations to the both of you. You are the winners. Woo woo. Woo woo. Everybody seems to love you both. You both did good. Um, yeah, great. This one, of course, is still in stock, so you can purchase it now. And this one, unfortunately, sad to see you go. <laughs> But uh, yeah, it's still a pretty good item. I, I, I love it. I love you. You were so good when you were with us. Everyone loved to use you and purchase you. You just gave a fabulous style to everybody who used you. Beach Club is pretty awesome. I do know that they used this guy at probably something like Coachella, where all those people are doing different hairstyles. I, I'm pretty sure IGK gets used a lot there all those braids and styles all right everybody now it's your turn go ahead comment below tell me which one is your favorite either the matrix or the beach club have you tried any of these let me know in the comments below and i will feature you in next week's video we do have a feature comment this week this one comes from crafty idea she says Thank you so much for the visit. You're welcome. Disney Princess is really my favorite. Yes, I love Disney Princess as well. I did, however, use the other palette, the My Little Mermaid, on my IGTV. Just a little plug there. Uh, check that out on my Instagram. Um, but yes, Disney Princess. That was a fun palette. I am loving the colors on it. And I love that it is square, a little bit more compatible with my purse which by the way is a little mermaid purse uh, <laughs> if it's perfectly in there and uh, just kind of I mean I'm sure it's probably not something that is meant for on the go but I will probably take it on the go <laughs> if you haven't seen that last video it's about Disney princesses and yes I am wearing a Disney hat go check that out it's my past videos there's also another comment that I wanted to mention it is about my Paul Mitchell's video, Thicken Up. So it is being sold again at paulmitchell.com. If you go check it out. Uh, I did want to say thank you so much for the comment. Letting me know that it is not discontinued or sold out. And it is still there online. Either it just got back in stock or I did a funny silly little thing. I did notice that... When you are about to purchase it, because I did this twice, and my boyfriend was the one that was like, uh, you have to click the size. So even though there's only one size for it, they still want you to click on the size. And then, of course, the amount that you want to put in your cart, and then go ahead, add to cart. If you don't click on the size, it will not add to your cart. So that is something that I probably did, thinking that it was sold out. So just a little heads up on that. And of course, you can do that on any other video. If you notice that something got sold out or discontinued, feel free to leave a comment below to like mention that something got discontinued. I also did want to mention that I do usually look only at the main stores like Ulta, Sephora, and of course their main website would be my number one go-to place that I would like to purchase an item. I do sometimes mention CVS and Target or some other smaller places like that. But other than that, I stay where it is safe and I don't really mention anywhere else that might be, you know, independent because those ones are again like the websites like eBay, Amazon, they're kind of enter at your own risk. So with that being said, again, just be careful out there. And thanks everybody for keeping a heads up on where to find these products. 
I am absolutely loving it. And yeah, that would be all. So see you guys next week. Keep on loving makeup and keep on rocking. Bye.